hello guys today i am going to show you how to validate the password field see uh, see normally uh, i am uh, in a previous session i showed you how to validate uh, um, the entire uh, 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 data uh, in a email uh, box as a email so if i something i typed and uh, do a login it will throws me that enter the correct email id so like that the password field i want to um, make uh, like this okay if i try to enter some um, uh, values uh, that uh, default it should be uh, looks like the password uh, so like this uh, dot 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 instead of uh, coming the text uh, so uh, so how to achieve this uh, today we going to see so uh, this is my uh, blank login so uh, if i uh, um, uh, type email address validation uh, is uh, fine now so now um, here uh, I try to enter some uh, password that should not be uh, shared with anyone uh, because password is really product right? but what I am trying to uh, add the password uh, it uh, it's just showing me that uh, whatever order I am typing so this is not a uh, really a uh, sensitive one because uh, normally uh, if you uh, doing such a operation in uh, some unauthorized uh, sorry uh, not uh, uh, unknown places so the people can able to easily track this password uh, by uh, adding some screen recording or uh, something uh, or the capture capturing mechanism they can easily capture this credentials so i instead of uh, this i want to um, apply like uh, whatever i'm typing it, sh it should come like a uh, dot 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 it's uh, so how to achieve that yes so here um, this is my login uh, page uh, okay uh, this is strongly typed that is connected with uh, the model called login view model that is my strongly type here I, I i am just applying my all my data annotations so what we you have to do is here you should uh, set uh, data types first data type call to data type dot password so you will tell that this is a password field and uh, and if you are using the MEC5, so here I am using the MEC5. Instead of text box, you will uh, get the HTML helper uh, called the password for. So password for it will help us to uh, make uh, that very uh, securely uh, that uh, whatever you are typing, it will in a front uh, end it will uh, shows a dot 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 uh, like this. So um, let me go on to build again my application to see the changes. So I I changes uh, two changes only I did one is uh, in my login view model uh, I applied the data type uh, this is uh, basically inherit the namespace data annotation that is already added in my application so you should add this uh, this will uh, provide you all the validation stuffs so for that uh, then uh, then uh, you can uh, if you are using the latest version of MVC you can go ahead and use the um, password uh, for uh, HTML helper this will help us uh, really a lot so le uh, my application is built and now uh, let me go and refresh the page again okay my page got loaded this time I go on to try something okay here to millinator and I'm trying to apply the password see now it is uh, coming as dot dot it's a really password product so whatever you are typing it, it won't show in a browser level and it's a uh, hider as a password and uh, this will uh, normally if you uh, knows the HTML how uh, we are setting the password type password the same thing the HTML helper helper helps us to do that if you inspect uh, and see how that uh, uh, password for is uh, generated in a uh, uh, browser ID and the name and the type password so this is the way it will give the result hopes you understand uh, try the same it will works perfectly thanks for watching the video guys please subscribe our channel if you not subscribed before to get more updates